So what do you do with all the punch boards from the game box? Hey everyone, here's a quick video on what to do with all the punch boards from the game board box once you've finished punching out all those tokens. My name is John McCann and I'm the Tabletop Tutor. We just opened our copy of the Quacks of Quedlinburg and there were eight layers of punch boards filled with tokens. Once you finish punching out all those tokens, do you throw away the punch boards? Not necessarily. Here's what I do. First, reassemble the game box with all the bags, pieces, and player boards. Second, notice how there is now a gap between the game boards and the top of the box. Add layers of punch boards until your game fits snugly against the top of the box. In this case, three punch boards seem to do the trick. Third, take everything out of the box, including that fancy game divider that was in the bottom. Fourth, place the layers of punch board into the bottom of the box. Try to use the most solid pieces for extra support. If my game came with extra rules in other languages or extra bits that are not needed for normal gameplay, then I'll tuck them away down here too if they fit. Fifth, replace the fancy game divider, then reload all the game pieces. Sixth, now your game fits snugly in the box and will be less likely to get mixed up the next time you open it up to play. Thank you for watching this tabletop tutorial for how to use all the punch boards in your game box. My name is John McCann and I am the Tabletop Tutor. If you got value out of this video, please click the like button. And if you enjoyed this video and would like to follow along as I share more tips and tricks for the gaming hobby, please find the subscribe button so you don't miss any of my upcoming episodes. That's all for now and I look forward to seeing you at the gaming table.